Hello, hello, this is Daniel from Trusted Tutorials and today we're gonna have a look at how to add access titles in Google Sheets. There's two different ways in uh, doing so. There's a really easy way where you almost have to do nothing and there is a little bit more complicated way to add access titles or also to edit access titles. But I'm going to show you everything you need to know. Let's get uh, started and jump right in. So I prepared a little data set here with X values and Y values. X values are mainly just the names of um, the um, items I have here in this uh, data set and here I have the amounts in the data set. And I would like to create a nice looking chart and also name the axis. All right, so I first show you the simple way to do it the first thing you do is you just mark everything. So all the data need to be marked and then you go uh, onto the menu item insert. After that, you click onto chart here. And once you click that, you see that Google Sheets will create a chart, including the axis titles. So we have here X values and Y values, which works really, really great. So uh, what do you do if you would like to rename access titles in Google Sheets? Also really easy. You just double click on it and then the uh, chart editor opens up. And here in the chart editor until, under title text, you can add the values. So uh, I can just name that items and I hit enter and click somewhere else. And as you can see, real time, the access title has changed. What I can also do is I just can double click into it and change it right in um, the chart. So I could say here we have the amounts and I hit enter. And after that, as you can see, real time it's changed and I have nice looking axis titles for the X and for the, for the Y axis. Perfect. So this works really, really well. And now I show you the second option. So let's suppose we haven't marked the uh, data yet and I go to insert and then chart. And now um, the chart opens up, uh, but there's no data in it. And also we could have the case where the chart editor is closed. What you would do here is you just click into the chart once. Now it's highlighted. And then I go on to the three dots or the hamburger menu. I click on it and then I go on to edit chart. And now the uh, chart editor opens up. So once the chart editor is opened up, I go onto the second menu here or the second option, which is customize. And um, yeah, well, I have to add data first, obviously for this to work. So let's uh, do that uh, quickly. I add here a series. Um, so I just click on add series and now it asks me to select a range. So I'm just going to select here the amounts and hit enter. So as you can see now, we have a nice column chart with the amounts in it. We also need to add the X axis. I uh, click on it and then I select here. Oh, I need to do it again. Chart editor, edit chart, X axis. And then I click here on uh, select data range and I just select that right here and I hit OK. Now, as you can see, I have the X values and the Y values in uh, the chart. And now we would like to add the access title. So I go once again on Customize. And here we have a menu option. The second uh, option here is Chart and Access Titles. So I just click on that. And then a, um, we have a menu here in the beginning, a drop down where I can change the chart title the subtitle, horizontal and vertical access titles. So if I want to change the access titles, I choose the uh, last two. So let's change the horizontal access title first. So uh, let's uh, call this um, items. So you see under title text, I can just type in items and I hit enter. And as you can see now, we have a chart access title. For the vertical axis, I do the same. I just select it here, vertical axis, and here I um, write amounts and I hit enter again. And as you can see, we now have both access titles in there. Yeah. Now we're already at the end of tutorial. Thank you so much uh, for watching and see you again soon and goodbye. This was Daniel from Trust Tutorials. Thank you so much.